An independent candidate for Brikama Area Council, Chairman Sib Ahmed Gita, said he will heavily invest in new development if he becomes victorious in the May 20th local government elections. The Kitty born politician said he has a $30 million in entrepreneurship investment plan for the youth of the West Coast region if the people voted him as a chairman. Jita was among the last candidates to file Indian nominations on, th on Tuesday rather, at the Independent Electoral Office in Birkama. Let's see details of that in this report. As an independent contestant following the ruling National People's Party's selection of CDC say, as its flag bearer for the West Coast Region Chairmanship. After filing his nomination papers to the IEC in Birkama, Gite, who calls himself the Honey Badger, told journalists that he has a massive investment plan for the youth, especially on this current situation of unemployment in the country. He said today many young people are engaged in drug abuse and peddling just to satisfy their frustration from lack of employment and tangible means for self-finance. I'd like to engage young people into meaningful development activities either through sports or entrepreneurship programs as you're aware there are a lot of there are a lot of um, young people who finished university who finished college education but are not able to um, uh, get jobs to help either their parents or their families that they've established so if they go through these troubles and these stresses they try to get consolement. They try to get happiness from somewhere, like drug addiction. We would like to, as I've said over and over, uh, put in place a program that will allocate at least 30 million dollars for the young people of this uh, region, just for entrepreneurship what, programs. What are your priorities? So in case you happen to win this seat? Number one priority is to make sure that we understand. Um, the problems that are, you know, in the council as an administration. How many staff do we have? How much income do we generate? And uh, what is our balance sheet? Are we generating income? Are we not? Are there deficiencies? We know there are, but uh, how, how big are these or how serious are these problems? We would like to understand those. But when we are able to get that, you know the Local Government Act 2002 has a lot of problems. It limits the uh, powers and the ability of the council. So we would like to look into that holistically with our National Assembly members and stakeholders to make sure we appeal to central government to either amend the Local Government Act to, uh, uh, to empower Gide said he understands and feels the problems of his people and has concrete plans that will address issues of scholarship challenges, waste management hurdles and other immediate issues of his area of contest. I know the problems of our people, problems of water, problems of education and scholarships for our children, problems of um, um, waste management, problems of environment, problems of health care, problems of infrastructure. So these are things I know and I've put plans in place to uh, make sure that uh, when I get this position I would definitely uh, change the situation of our people for better. And our people know about these. The Carnifin Municipal Council mayoral race might be tough, but among the most anticipated results the people would love to see is the outcome of the Birkama Area Council Chairmanship, as many described it as a tight one between the UDP flag bearer Yankuba Dabo and Ahmed Jite Independent alongside NPP CDC say. In few weeks' elections, doubts will be cleared and the elected candidates will mount the mantle of leadership in their various councils. Reporting for iAfrica News, I am Maria Macham.